now you have your pressure switch or your automatic temperature control in this case and you'll see that the switch has a, a square to it and we've got a square hole it's going into we're just going to line that up into that square hole you'll feel it drop into place and then just rotate it and you'll feel the clip lock into place on the console so that's all set now we just need to install our wiring harness push it on till you hear it click and once you hear that click when you push it in you're now ready to close the console back up so we're just going to roll it forward push the back corners down in push the front corners down into place and they snap when they latch in All we have left to do now is to put our knob back on and your knob has a, a flat spot on it the same as the shaft does so it's just a matter of putting the knob back onto the shaft lining up that flat spot pushing it into place just rotate it to make sure it moves smoothly which it does and now you're ready to plug your washer back in reconnect your hoses if need be and your repair is complete mm -hmm.